Ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in betweens, hello and welcome back to TIE Fighter Reimagined. I'm Computer, and last episode we tried to capture the leaderships of the Demok and the Ripoplis to stop their civil war. What we ended up finding instead were their children. I'm not entirely sure what their plans were there. Maybe the children were supposed to be used as mutual hostages in lieu of each side trusting the other. Either way, uh, we have the children now, apparently, so they've joined forces anyway. So I guess that worked out for them. And um, I'm pretty sure we're going to have a big battle now. And I'm right. That doesn't make me feel better, but sure. That is a beautiful ship. I like the one with the, the ones with the double, though, but I don't know. As we feared, both the Demok and the Ripoplus have put aside their differences and are preparing a joint effort to push us out of the system. Although we had hoped to bring about a peaceful settlement, them turning against us was not part of the plan. Despite this setback, there is of course no possibility of them succeeding in driving us out. As a result, Admiral Harkov has arranged for substantial reinforcements which should arrive imminently. They will include the escort carrier Tropsabor, bringing several squadrons of TIEs, and two support ships, the Nebulon B frigate Swift and the strike cruiser Indefatigable. Additionally, Harkov has managed to persuade Sector HQ to give him a squadron of the very latest and new TIE starfighter designs being developed by Admiral Zarin, the TIE Advanced. Though these are still in their early experimental stage, they are immensely superior compared to any of our current fighter designs, with exceptional speed, maneuverability, large missile base, and a shield generator. They should easily outmatch anything the opposing side can throw at us. You will be flying a TIE fighter designated Alpha 2 with five wingmen. Your fighter has been specially outfitted with concussion missiles, though with limited space you can only have four. We expect this to be a full-scale combined attack by both enemy factions using the bulk of their capital assets against us. Your primary responsibility will be to defend our capital ships from any enemy fighters making torpedo runs. Once we've destroyed enough of the enemy fleet, we expect the remainder to flee. One way or another though, this conflict ends here. Harkov has managed to get ships with crews previously under his command assigned to him for this mission. Given recent discoveries of Imperial arms and equipment amongst both the Demox and the Ribblebliss, there are suspicions that Harkov himself may be up to something here. Keep an eye out for any other ships that may arrive to rendezvous with Harkov and inspect it. Sounds good. But, yeah. The Demox and Ribblebliss are joining forces for one final effort to push us out of the system. They have assembled the bulk of their fleets, which comprise of several heavy cruisers, frigates, and corvettes, along with dozens of starfighters. Admiral Harkov has therefore called in substantial reinforcements to help us turn back the attack. All available squadrons will be deployed to engage the enemy. Your squadron, TIE Fighter Group Alpha, will be tasked with engaging enemy bombers threatening our own capital ships. Our own bombers will launch waves of torpedo attacks against the enemy capital fleet covered by our other TIE squadrons. Harkov has also procured one of the first batches of the new TIE Advanced Starfighter, or Avenger as the test pilots like to call it, designed by Admiral Zarin. This will be their first true test in combat. Once the enemy fleet is broken, we can finally put an end to this conflict and provide peace, order, and security for the citizens of this war-torn system. Um, yeah, they'll be very happy about that, I'm sure. Also, the Demok and um, are joining for pause, please. That's the Akaga. But it was called the Algos here. Also, I'm I don't appreciate you teasing with the, the Tie Advanced. Like, yeah, we are also getting Tie Advanced now. You'll be fighting a Tie Fighter though. That's that's not appreciated, but funny. Anyway, let's get on with it. I appreciate the humor, but not the reality. Warheads, missiles, 
sounds good. Torpedoes? No. No. Oh, I'll be fighting those uh, Y-wings with turrets. They'll probably shoot down the torpedoes. So let's go with... Uh, oh, right. 75% um, of all Demok forces must be destroyed. 75% of all Ripoblis forces must be destroyed. All Imperial starships, specifically, must survive. Which is fine. Let's double check. Akaga. Yes. Oh. Right. Here we have... Oh. Escort carrier drops aboard, hailing Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector. We're ready to support you, Admiral. Die Fighter Alpha, rendezvous with the drops aboard. Sure thing. Wait, are you... No, no. I'm just going to... <sighs> rendezvous. I do not have my hopes up. Fighters, tie interceptors, nice. We have a modified Corvette. Another modified Corvette, cargo ferry. Um, yeah. Battle stations, hostile ships have entered the system. I wonder what that rendezvous thing was all about. I couldn't talk with it. Enemy squadrons launching. Let's beat them head on. Wait, you have a No 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 acclimator. Yes, yes, yes. Uh it looked from this angle like something uh, more rebel like. Let's go have some fun. Tie bomber squadron launching. Concentrate on enemy cruisers. Oh, you're not dead yet. That could have ended badly. Uh, wait. Y-wings, uh, not the other, the other type of Y-wing, please. Order acknowledged. Engaging your target. Thank you. My friends, or my squadron, I should say, to attack this type for now, because they're the closest. Nice. But we have. That's good enough. You were attacking my friends. That's not that's not an okay thing for you to do. Um That's what two. Show me the uh, oh hello. Yeah. Um, never mind. Uh that's another one. Bombers, cloak, my wings. 
But what about the Y-Wing Bees? Where did they go? Maybe they haven't shown up yet. And speaking of which, let's go back to getting the messages. Hey, two! Attacking craft dead ahead! I am! This or, is five. I've got a starship firing at me. I was about to. Hello. Oh, just... Really? Got him. Oh, that's wrong once. The protector is under attack. All forces respond. Wait. This is three. There. I've got a starship firing at me. What are you actually shooting at? Isn't that uh, when I target this and press A to target thing attack uh, thing targeting the protector? This is one. I'm heavily damaged. I'm thinking I only get Ooh, oh hello. Oh, you died. Good. Oh, there you are. What? Please don't hit me. This is three. I'm heavily damaged. All right. Sure. I am in the kill zone right now. So I will be going elsewhere. Thank you. Where are you? Z ninety five. Well, hold on. Demog forces delayed ninety seven percent. Ripper Bliss inspect mysterious shuttle. Oh, you better not leave before I get there. How long ago did you come out? Pretty long time ago, it seems. Yeah, pretty long time ago. And until I actually get a beat on you, like an ID at least, if not an inspection, I don't know how far away from your hyper... hyperspace point you are. Three kilometers. Hello. Ooh. Never mind, never mind. Alpha oh. two, stick to your mission profile, please. One of the Demo cruisers has been destroyed. Your curiosity is gonna cause you serious trouble someday. Die fighter Alpha. Rendezvous with the drop score. Alpha 2, don't attack this shuttle or face a severe penalty. Hmm. I expect I will... Oh! How... how... how sad. Wait. There's just you left? Uh, not much left of you, either, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, 90% of Ripple's forces... 97% uh, rather. What are we missing? Everything is red. Oh, hello. Yeah. 
anyway. Uh, I was asked to your command ship, but I was asked to go to the Tropsable, I think. Nope. There you are. Hiding. So, rebel leaders going to see... You know what? Now I'm going to follow orders for the moment. And rendezvous with the tropes aboard. Even though it seems a little odd. But yeah, rebel leaders coming to see Harkov. How odd. Also, I do love this hangar. Like, just the design of this ship is so utilitarian. Oh, hello. All right, daylight, fine. Speeding up, we do. Uh, shuttle Umblaut has entered hangar. Even more curious. Let's avoid the engines for the moment. Hello. Excellent work, pilot. Thank you. I don't think your commanding officers agree. Select representatives are brought from the two warring worlds to hear message from Admiral Holcorp, I believe I said. Kind of missed the other half of that sentence, but fine. The civil war that has ravaged your planets is over. It is time to lay down your arms. Join us to rebuild all that was destroyed in this savage conflict. Even now, the process of repairing your planets has begun. Yes, of course. Thank you. I will accept that. Yes, it looks very beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. Superb work. You have successfully helped turn back the combined attack by the Demok and Ripoblis, destroyed most of their fleet without suffering any major losses on our side, and brought about an end to this conflict. With their fleets defeated, both sides will have no choice now in accepting Imperial rule and our terms for a peaceful resolution to this terrible conflict. The Thai advanced also performed magnificently once we were able to get them on the field. Admiral Zarin will be most interested in the results. It would be wise for you to brush up on your skills by doing some training with this new craft. Overall, you should be very proud of the fact that you helped bring order and stability to this once war-torn system. The evidence you have gathered for us has been incredibly important. Shuttle Omlot's passenger was a member of the Rebel Alliance. The individual was apparently taken directly to Admiral Harkov, and they have been alone ever since. This is very alarming in light of our investigation into the chronic shortages of equipment reported by Harkov over the last few months. It seems clear he is selling Imperial weapons and supplies to whoever has the credits, even rebel terrorists. Yeah, he is doing that. We already knew that from the previous uh, cutscene, but yeah. Yes, my... My goal of failing ever upwards is bearing fruit, apparently. I feel like I destroyed more than just six ships. But uh, I'm not going to argue much. Sir, check messages. Yes, yes, I will. Um, in a moment, I'm just thinking about something. No. Um, I mean, from the Secret Order's perspective, it could be that uh, Harkov was meeting with a double agent as well. You know, you have to give some benefit of the doubt. He's an admiral after all. It's 
see. Do we have anything new here? Doesn't seem except the medal. Yes, medal of unity. Uh, bit sarcastic, maybe, because we beat them into being unified. But sure. Marksman fourth class, ninety-seven percent now. So, getting there. And encrypted sender, encrypted message. Pack your things. I am quiet, uh, quietly arranging your transfer. Things are not what they seem, and we cannot afford to lose your talents. Expect word of your official transfer from your commander soon. Serve the Emperor above all others. Thank you. I kind of don't want to be here anymore anyway. Commander Johan Tarkis, transfer. Command has requested your transfer to the VSD stalwart under command of Vice Admiral Thrawn. Nice, we get to join our friend, apparently. The shuttle will be leaving at 0300 um, Imperial Center time. Report to the deck officer upon your arrival. Commander Johan Trakis, or Tharkis, possibly. Wing Commander, VSD Protector. Wing Commander? That's another intellectual property, but sure. And yeah. I didn't realize our venture with Harkov was this short. Then again, you kind of have to read the strategy guide to get the full story in the original TIE Fighter. You're really like, between battles, you, there's not much to do. And you certainly don't get any emails about anything, so there's that. Now, I do love this, because it actually adds an actual story for you to follow in the game. Whereas before it was just, well, not just, but it was mostly just 76 missions. And there was a story in there, but not much of one, I suppose. Anyway, I'm babbling at this point. And with that babbling over and done with, ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, I've been Computer, this has been TIE Fighter Reimagined, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.